so we have today we have a problem this problem and you can see in this problem we have two tractors here which are pulling a log and one tractor that is applying a force of FA that is at the angle of 30 degrees where the force B that is at the angle of theta and theta is already given here that is 15 degrees now uh, if the magnitude force magnitude of the force resultant force is 10 kN and to be directed along the x axis we have to find the two towing forces FA and FB ok so let's start first let's draw the free body diagram uh, we can see here if we are considering this is our y axis and this is our x axis ok now with respect to y axis we can consider f of a is applied this is f of a we can say this is f of a and this f of a is being considered at an angle of 30 degrees ok the next force that is given to us that is f of b this force is considered to be f of b and the angle with respect to x axis is given and that is 15 degrees because you can see here set the angle theta that is equal to 15 degrees now this third force or we can consider regarding the resultant that is given to us and this resultant is along the positive x axis this is given along the positive x axis you can say this is f of r this is directed along the x axis and now if we can say that the value of this resultant is 10 newton 10 kilo newtons okay so this is the data that has been provided to us now we have to find the forces fa and fb fa and fb in order to find force fa and fb we will apply the usual technique that is aid the vectors by head to tail rule method now first we will aid fa and fb you can see if this is 15 degrees and this is 30 degrees so a complete angle in between these both forces is 13 plus 15 degrees which will be equals to 45 degrees ok so if I am going to add this force B with force A that means this will be added with force A at an angle of 45 degrees so let's take an angle of 45 degrees ok we can say if I am going to extend this force of F of A so this angle this angle at this point will become 45 degrees because these both lines are parallel and if we are going to consider this interior angle that will be 180 minus 45 ok let's angle uh, elongate this resultant a bit ok so now you can see here we have a triangle here this is 30 degrees this is 180 degrees minus 45 and this third angle can also be found by the sum of the angles of a triangle minus these both angles ok now let's rewrite this shape again this is f of a ok and 
the second is now this is f of b and the third is f of r that is from this point to this point ok so we can say this is our f of a this is f of b and this angle we can consider that this is 30 degrees whereas this angle as we have considered 180 degrees minus 45 degrees so it will be 5 3 and 1 so it will be 135 degrees for this angle we can say this will also become equal to let's consider this is the phi and for phi we can say this is equals to 180 minus 135 minus 30 degrees okay so this will be minus 135 and 30 this will be 165 okay so 180 minus 165 and it will give us 15 degrees so we can say this phi is basically equals to 15 degrees okay and this is our f of r now the value of f of r is given that is 10 kilo newton now we have to find f of b and f of a you can see here all the angles are given and one side is also given so we can utilize the sine rule here utilizing the sine rule you can say sine rule for as we are going to find the sides so it will be for sides okay so for sides we know that that is if a over the opposite angle that will be sine 15 which will be equals to f of b sine 30 and this will be equals to f of r sine 135 so f of a upon sine 15 now we have given here the value of f of r so we can compare f of a and f of r sine 15 is equals to f of r upon sine 135 so f of a upon sine 15 is equals to 10 upon sine 135 ok so f of a will be equals to 10 sine 15 upon sine 135 degrees so the value of f of a now can be equals to as it is given that is 10 10 sine 15 upon sine 135 so the value that I have calculated here that is 3.6 6 newtons sorry this will be the kilo newtons so now for similarly for f of b we can apply f of b upon sine 30 and this will be equals to f of r upon sine 135 ok so f of b upon sine 30 will be equals to 10 upon sine 135 and f of b is equals to 10 sine 30 upon sine 135 so the value for f of b will becomes equals to 7.07 .07 k 
kilo in nutrients. So this is the, these are the both results. F is equal 3.66 and 7, FOB is 7.07.